Rosano! Keep it going! Don't stop! Don't fucking stop! Oh my god. So where is Ben? I don't even fucking know. It's crazy. Hey guys, I just discovered, I made a discovery. I discovered that I'm able to walk into any gated community simply by walking up to the gate with a leaf blower. <laughs> just, to, just let it right in. No questions asked, just, there we go. Wait. Yeah, I also discovered that every zoo is a petting zoo if you got the balls. Because I don't care what that sign says, I'm going to touch a tiger. Cross on a bucket list. It's my time. Man. My mom, my mom has five kids, but uh, she's not fertile, she's accident prone. Yeah. I'm one of them, okay? Like I said before, my name is Juan. With a name like Juan, you can assume that I'm fluent in Spanish, but I'm not. You know, but I, you know, it's kind of weird, but I should know more Spanish than I do now, because true story, both my parents are from Mexico, okay? When my dad first came to this country, he learned English from listening to the Beatles. Yeah, all his life he kept calling houses Yellow Submarines. Because we all live in Yellow Submarines. I remember, I remember one time he came home from a hard day's night. <laughs> He's all like, hey Jude. I'm like, my name's Juan. <laughs> like, you know that. You're the one who named me after yourself. <laughs> He's like, don't talk to me that way. I am Dolores. <laughs> yeah, that's your grounded for eight days a week. <laughs> I'm like, this one's seven days in a week. How's that impossible? Hey, just let it be. <laughs> and I let it be. That's very mad. My parents fought a lot growing up. Like, they hated each other so much. Like, I could tell what time of year it was by the way they argued. Like, when I hear my dad go to my mom, what? Look, what, what is this, gifts? These toys? We can't afford these things. First of all, you want the kids. If you love them that much, you pay for the gifts with your own money. It's Christmas. And then when I hear my, my mom go to my dad, I don't care if you plants tonight. It's girls' night. Or I'm painting on my eyebrows, I'm good to go. Okay? You stay here with the kids, all right? It's girls' night. It's Valentine's Day. <laughs> and then when I hear my dad go to my mom, you and the kids were the best things that have ever happened to me. It's April Fool's Day. <laughs> oh, it's a jokester. Yeah, they fought so much, it wasn't uncommon to see my dad on the couch like every single morning. My dad would be on the couch every morning sleeping. It was not a good sight to see when you're a kid. Like, I remember one time I like, I'm on the kitchen table trying to eat my cereal, and I see my dad on the couch, and I try to be really, really quiet, and I pour milk into my Rice Krispies. I'm like, shh, snack, crackle, pop, no! Be quiet. Text me later. Yeah, man. Yeah, they, they hated shirts. They tried to get a divorce, but couldn't afford it. So, what they did to raise money was have a garage sale. It's weird, I was there, I saw this firsthand, and it was like, okay, at least we're doing something. And my dad's outside going all like, everything must go, including her. <laughs> and walking around the driveway, I could see this one table, and I was kind of heartbroken going when I saw this, because all my old toys, and I still played with them, and like, I was like, ouch, you know? So I had to say goodbye to my toys, I'm like, he-man, Power Rangers, and I saw my four favorite ones, my Ninja Turtles. And I said goodbye. I was like, oh no, Leonardo, Raphael, Donatello, Raphael. I miss you most of all. I hear her talking to me like, go bunga. I'm like, shh. <laughs> Just go, Ninja, go, Ninja, go. <laughs> Just go, Ninja, go, Ninja, go. <laughs> yeah, I got in a car accident a while ago and my car got totaled, so I didn't have a car for a while. So I had to call my friends to give me rides. So one time my, my friend came by and he came by and picked me up on his moped. <laughs> and he's like, sorry, Juan, but you gotta ride, bitch. <laughs> I'm like, dude, on the moped, we're both riding, bitch. <laughs> And get the memo. <laughs> oh, I guess. Um, I got a girlfriend right now. She's real cool and all, whatever. But she's kind of like, she's never seen Star Wars ever, you know? And one time I was like, like we're at home and I was like, hey, let's watch Star Wars. And she said no, because she's afraid that if she watches Star Wars, she might like it. 
And by liking it, she'll automatically become a nerd. Like she believes that, it's in her head, you know? So I had to comfort her, it's like, hey baby, honey pie, love of my life. You're not smart enough to become a nerd. And she took it as a compliment. It's like, Buon lasagna, everybody!